Hi there! As a tie-in knot in sport climbing, I like to use the figure of eight or the bowline. And let me show them. So first the figure of eight, to measure it, I like to take the length of my arm. Then I move the rope around like a circle into the loop from inside out. Then I pull it and yeah, make sure that it's still long enough. I put it through the tie-in loops, both of them, close to the harness, and then I follow it At the end, I pull it and make sure that the end is also long enough. The advantage of the figure of eight is that it is um, easier to check, but it's a little bit harder to untie if you are projecting and take a fall. And this is why I um, like to use the bowline as well. I always um, put the knot at the end of the rope so it gets blocked just in case it would slip through the belaying device and i usually use the figure of eight on the bite so this is how i do it the whole way around through the loop and pull it on all four ends and here we are now you can see where the knot got his name from. It looks like a figure of eight. So for the bowline, I used to go with the rope through the two loops. I usually go from bottom to top. Then I measure a little bit longer than my knee. I make one loop, take the rope from underneath go through the loop by forming another. Then I take the other side of the rope, I mean my end and not the belayer's end, which would be this one. I go through the loop and I pull at the other side so the knot kind of jumps over. And then I follow the rope through the two loops. And the whole way until the end. So here we are. And this is the bowline and it's easier to untie. And that's why I like to use it when projecting. <laughs>